A very good day to you. Let's look at how to now restore backups that we have previously created. Okay, basically what we've done, we've booted up from the Windows 10 USB or the DVD. It depends on how you want to boot it up. Okay. Click Next. And that was the previous window that comes straight after it starts up. Okay, then click on Repair Your Computer. Okay, troubleshoot, advanced. Now we could go to the command prompt. Okay, and let's just see which our drivers, because when we boot it up, the drives might become different. Okay, so let's just type in C and then DIR just to make sure that this is actually the Windows directory that we had before, the Windows um, drive. Okay, before we had restored. I mean, done the backups to E drive. Now it should probably have been changed to D. Let's just check. Yeah, there we go. We have our Windows image backup. Okay, now W B A D M I N. Okay. Start recovery. Okay. And if you want to see how to run this command, you press over there. Okay, and we'll scroll through the list. Okay, let's just go up. The one that we're trying to use is this command right over there. Okay, so we'll just copy it down. Okay, makes it easier than having to type it. Okay, paste it over there. Now, what we need to do is get the version. Okay, so we'll just keep this here. Items that we're trying to restore is the C drive. Okay, and we'll just press enter over here. It won't find that. It'll just say no backup was found. So now what we need to do is WBADMIN. Okay, get version. Okay, and then it's backup target. And the backup location now is D, our D drive. Okay, get version, sorry. Okay, and the latest one that we had was this. So all we need to do is copy, sorry, copy that. Okay, if you just right click, it should copy automatically. Now we can go back to our previous one. And we just need to change the version over there. Right click again, just paste it in. That's that. Item type volume, item C. Make sure we give it again. Where are we getting it from? So backup target. Where are where the backups are stored? In this case it is D as we've shown. Okay. And what it will do is do you want to continue? Press Y, capital Y, enter, running recovery operation for volume C, and this will go through. Okay, so now it's restored everything. Now we need to also think about restoring maybe apps or whatever that was not restored. This we can restore once we're back into Windows, and then we use the same command but we change volume to app okay um there is another option that we need to consider at this point and i'll close this down and we'll go back to troubleshoot advanced okay and then it's system image recovery windows 10 and this is a quicker way to recover basically the last backup, okay? But it's only giving you your last backup, you see? The command prompt that we used before gave you multiple options. You could go into different versions of backups, uh, kind of like restore it. But this is the quicker way, okay? It's just giving you the last option and then you just click next, okay? Format and repartition disks, beautiful, beautiful. Click next is going back to the next, the last thing. All this will be erased and formatted, etc. 
and then it'll go through this and then just kind of like at the end of it it'll restart and you're back into your Windows 10. Okay, so you've had multiple options for restoring backups. Hopefully this has helped. Thank you for watching.